Alright, he's back here. We got a no cooling call. I was at this call maybe last month. I think it's the same unit. The guy says it's not cooling. Uh, we replaced the thermostat. And uh, he had a echo bit at first. But it was, I think it was some wires in the uh, wall that was chewed up. So we replaced the thermostat wire going to the unit. And uh, But I gave him a loan of thermostat. So he called me about a couple of days ago. Well, yesterday he said the unit's not cooling. Oh, and he said, by the way, he got the new thermostat, but he still hasn't had a chance to remount it and, and give me my old thermostat back because I've been charging for the loaner because he wanted the Echo B. So we're going to see what's going on because I kind of had a suspicion that I'm going to see if that fuse blown. I'm going to try to see if he tries to replace that thermostat itself. You know what I'm saying? And blow the fuse or something. You know how that goes. We ain't gonna scratch it late. I think it is the same unit though. Cause you say, man, we just been having so much trouble with that downstairs unit. I think since he's been, I think we put a new compressor in there. About, about four years ago, I haven't had this stuff for a good little while. But, uh, I'm gonna take my bucket here though. We're gonna see what's wrong with it. Give me a bucket. Echo be in. And I'll shoot cover. See if I got a thing with that screwdriver. Yeah, here we go. I get a flashlight. Shoe cover, drill, meager. Got some jumpers in there. Man, I got to clean this truck out. I might do a live clean the truck out. Somebody want me to do a truck tour. Might be a good time to do that. Small D wild light. Where's that? Oh, there go my auto right there. Small, my boy Eric found my small. Small, my subcontractor. I ain't had it in about three months. About to get some more carpet? Yeah, we're going to do some, some renovation. We need to okay. go on over doing the house. The mm -hmm. carpet they put in that on the stairs was a uh, floor carpet they had throughout the whole house one point. <laughs> so, oh, okay. But the kids kind of wreck it. But, oh, right. Yeah, yeah, I see it just in flash, huh? Yeah, I don't hear any noise coming from the air conditioner. I know it's not running. I just, I'm mm -hmm. not 100% sure what it could possibly be this time. It's the same thing. Oh, but, right. It's yeah, the front of the circuit, which is Yeah, good. it's calling for it. Let me see if the fan turned on. Yeah, I left it on there. I was going to. Install the other one, but I'm like, yeah, I'll just wait. And I'm like, I got it right there, but okay. Yeah, I went and like turned off the mode, everything, and okay, same like that on. fuse blowing again. Something going on out there. It's blinking. You should make a noise, right? Yeah, beep at you. Okay, just click. 
Yeah, it's been doing that. Okay, just click and it's, it's, it's not turning it's not up. Not kicking here. You okay. Hear All right. Uh, okay, and that's the Echo B right here. Oh, shoot. What's up? This is the Echo B? Yeah, yeah, that's okay. it. Okay. Yeah. All right. Want to go ahead and. Uh, my word going to start it while I'm here. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it. I'm going to go ahead and probably going to start it while yeah, I'm here. Hopefully hope yeah, it's just a yeah, fuse yeah, or something. Yeah. Okay. Absolutely. Do All what right. you got to do. Okay. I trust me. You know where, you know where everything yeah, is. Yes, sir. Oh, I do. All right. Lights are all over. So okay. Then. All right. Thanks, Walter. All right. I got you. You're coming on short notice. Yeah, no. No problem. All right. So the thermostat. Hey, Brian. Where's that light in the attic? I know. It's shooting the left hand side. I'm just pulling the light. Oh, okay, I got it. Okay. Yeah, I got it. Thank you. All right. Let's see. All right, folks. So, I'm still just blinking. Look at the Echo B box. I don't think he tried to replace it. It's not open. So my fuse, fuse is not blown. That's good. So I don't think it's a short again. Gotta be something different. Let's see if we get a code or something. One. So we're getting a steady flash. So I just ordered me another door switch because I don't know where mine at. So we got a slow flash, no call for the heat. Like they you kick them everywhere. All right, so I got flashing slow normal, no call for heat. Like I got a slow flash. I'm gonna run 
get something to hold this door switch. I don't see no tape or nothing up here. on this door switch so I can at least check the car. For both there, I'm gonna go to common and the green. Got zero. Common and wild one got zero. I'm not calling for it though. And, that, and that's a normal blink, like ain't nothing going on with it. Seems like something going on with that thermostat. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna jump it out right here. Y'all want to buy some jumpers? We got the. What we gonna call this? We can't use Jumper King. It's like Jumper King on the budget though. The Jumper Queen. So. Y'all contact me. I'll send you one of these. WWHVAC. I don't want to go with Queen. We gotta call it. Jumper solution or something. Ooh. Yeah, something going on with that uh, contact out there. I think. Contact short again. Let's, let's see what's going on out there. It's like a spark. Yeah, let's go outside again. Something going on with that contact out there. Water, I like, hope it ain't raining. Hope you get a storm. Hey, doggy. Hey, hey, what you been out to? Hmm. What you been out to? You playing with your toy, huh? All right, man, let's see what's going on here. time I just fixed this up in here. Just barely on here like that. It's 
Still should be enough to catch it though. Let's check this contact. There's some barrel on there too. Contact the bag, zero. Contact the bag. All right, folks, let me go tell them. All right, folks. So I'm gonna have to go back and look at that video, though. Okay. I thought I'd check that contact. I want to see what the rating was. I asked the homeowner. See that rat poop too? You can tell rats been down there, so you know something eating them up. Uh... I want to check the uh, rating on the, the thing on my last video. I'm gonna have to go back and look. I'm trying to see did I get a home on the option. I don't think I gave an option to go ahead and replace this contact. I just want to know if it was weak or not. So we're going to check the voltage. Like I say, man, that's what I'm going to have to start doing, though, because I don't like, uh, it's not necessarily a call back. Like, I guess it is. It's been a month, but that's a good learning experience for me. Go ahead and, uh, we got 245. I'm gonna turn the upstairs off while so y'all can hear me. That's a good learning experience for me. If I find a short in the thermostat wire, it's just like a uh, blower motor. Sometimes when you change the capacitor, a few days later that blower go out. So I'm gonna start telling the home on a hey, sometime the uh, that contact will go out since it's been shorted like that. Uh, water contact out. Right, we're going to check it again. Warm it out. Warm it out. Yeah, I got zero. Alright, so this is the new contact. Same thing. when I got 12. But I cut them a little slack, though I say, but they didn't want to go with my maintenance program. So I got hey, I can't be waving no diagnostic fees. If you go with my maintenance program, we'll waive a diagnostic fee, you know, a service fee.
So we got red to the right, blue to the left. Plug and play. Ain't no need to recreate the wheel. We want to get these nice and snug. We want to snap that contact. Someone jumping over from the capacitor. Dark out here. The rain gonna get us. We'll be on the inside by the end, though. Right. Make sure this one looks snug. Tack the in. Because one, I checked that contact the last time. Alright, so everything looks good out right here.
this back on. Make sure we gotta see what kind of resistance we got. Point seven. That's okay. All right, so we're gonna put this back on here. All right, so I'm gonna go turn it back on. I'm turning it back on. I'm gonna leave the liquid line off for now. Gotta change the wash on my hoses. Good heat. I'm not worried about the uh, high side liquid side. Got to change the washer, man. That thing leaking. I got some washers at the house. I need to just change them up. There you go, right there. All right, man. I'm gonna go change this thermostat up. Dark. All right, folks. Like I say, I'm gonna go, I'm going to uh, yeah, I'm gonna let discount on the contactor, and I'm gonna waive the service fee. It has been over a little bit over 30 days, but I'm just gonna put that towards the warranty. So, waive the service fee, save a little bit on the contactor, and I'm gonna change put the echo B on that form, but. I'm gonna let him do all the programming. I think he installed the first one. I'm not sure. So at least I'll get him to that point. I don't want to mess with my my thermostat and blow no fuse or nothing. Have us back out. So I'm gonna go ahead and replace that real quick. I figured there was going to be a good one of the turn out here. I was hoping for it. 
boy. That's pretty good though. I'll take it. I'll take it. That's good. Good and level. So we got a common. Got a green for fan. Echo B. Eco B. I start. And these and some commercial units when they first came out. Ten years ago. I said I wasn't going to set this up, but I can't be yeah, the homeowner like that. Right. I'm like, like I'm the homeowner. That's right. No, we did not use that. Break it down for me. That's right. Nope. The furnace. How do you want to travel by thermostat? Now your Echo B. The main floor. Connect to Wi Fi access. Use iPhone. I have to get the home on there. Alright, these big people. Thanks for watching. Like I say, man, this has been a good customer. So sometimes you don't charge for everything. So I'm gonna go ahead and hook this up for him. And I think he got an iPhone, so he on the phone now, but we gotta get the moving. So and you let him hook it up from, from, from here, but he don't need his iPhone. All right, appreciate it. Thanks for watching.